and today has just been great. It's a blessing for us to be part of it. You can feel the electricity in the air. Oh, the speakers were incredible. And I can't wait to uh, share with family and friends all the information that I've learned. These folks, along with hundreds of others, are experiencing a very different kind of business conference, one created by the Christian Professional Network. The Christian Professional Network is also a great resource to uh, small businesses, to people who are just starting out, to nonprofits, because it provides uh, not only those great networking opportunities, but it provides the materials that they need to really succeed in their business. And we're just very excited with the growth that we've seen. A one-day immersion in business excellence for the Christian business community. The CPN Conference gives attendees an opportunity to fellowship, learn, and network. Went to a couple of the marketing um, breakout sessions, which were excellent. I happened to do the two that back-to-back -back, um, marketing strategies and trying to make yourself unique, retaining customers. Development, fundraising, capital campaigns, identifying donors, that kind of thing. It was, they were marvelous sessions. I really enjoyed them. I've learned a lot already, and I know I'm going to learn a lot more. But I think all the speakers did a great job. I think their messages were timely. But these should not be uncertain times for Christians. Not in business, not in ministry, and not in life. Looking at excellence as opposed to just mediocrity. The stronger players will get better, and they will survive and thrive. I don't want to get to heaven and say, Lord, I would have read your book if I'd only had time. <laughs> When you become a Christian, you put on the whole armor of God, right? You slap a fish on the back of the truck, and all of a sudden, you're supposed to do business with you because you're a Christian. But what usually happens is they go, oh, you're a Christian. Can you do it for free? Oh my gosh, they were incredible. Incredible. We had a really good session about development and uh, just the whole science of fundraising and building relationships, which I think is so important for us. Um, and then, of course, the keynote's incredibly inspirational. So the concept of the pursuit of excellence, as opposed to being foreign to Christian business, ought to be the central part of Christian business. Pursuing Jesus through your business is the right priority for you to have. God's working in my life. He's working through my life, and other people are benefiting as a result of my life. You need to have that same kind of purpose. I've been in sales a long time, so, you know, sometimes you get in a rut and it's always nice to rehear it again and it's like, wow, you know, this is great, I can do this. This particular venue is a great opportunity for businesses, both large and small, to network, to understand not only their particular needs, but the needs of others that they may be able to service as well. So I was really just hoping to, to come to get encouraged, to, to talk with other Christian business owners to understand a little bit about the, the uh, what they do that works. Good networking, good vendors. I got um, leads, associations with people that I hadn't met, of course, before. And to be in a company of so many people who share my same convictions, really gratifying. At the end of the day's sessions and networking, there is a sense of renewal, both as Christians and business people. I could probably stand here all day and talk about how good this conference is. And this by far has really uh, it uh, exceeded my expectations. And it's a terrific venue to uh, just get together and spend a few hours with uh, a lot of different people, so I really enjoyed it. It was truly a wonderful, wonderful day. This is a very unique event. Uh, the very fact that uh, Christian business people can get together and encourage one another um, and just do some networking back and forth, see what God is doing in other parts of His kingdom, that's a great thing in itself. And, and I've enjoyed so much the uh, subject about excellence, pursuing excellence in business practices. And let me encourage you, if you're a business person today involved in some sort of a ministry, uh, this is an event that's an ongoing event and the next one you're going to want to be at because if the people who were here today are any um, indication, these are the best people in this community for you to be partnering with, for you to be networking with. So let me encourage you to be a part of the CPA. Mm -hmm.